gotta blip it. We are in Manchester, Iowa this weekend for three days of trials, starting out Friday night with some bike trials action. I'm on an actual trials bicycle. Hannah's gonna ride her mountain bike. Should be a good time. Section one. It's a good warm up. Uh. I'll take the long way so I don't pass you just yet. Oh, I could shortcut it right here. I'll let you go. Get the shot. Oh, yeah, nice. Let's see if I can follow that up. Time for a different bike. Riding the Ibis Mojo 4 now. Gonna see how well it handles all these steps. So smooth across there. This is where it gets hard though. Oh, I'm supposed to be up there. There we go. Good save. Huh. Yeah, I got a little lost. That's pretty nice right there. Real tight. <sighs> Final section. See if I can keep it clean. That's actually pretty fun there. Oh, this will be a little weird on this. It works. Success. All right, look at my hand. Uh, Final section, I think. Oh, nice rock garden. Oh, this does look tricky. Gotta pick a good line and keep it rolling. Nice. Sweet. Clean ending. Do I need to walk this? You might. You might want to. Oh, here we go. On the hospital. 
Yeah, yeah this is so much harder than the other one. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It works. And how was the bicycle trials for you? It was good. I had some tricky areas. I particularly liked actually the rocky part the most. I really enjoyed riding the Mojo. I thought it was a lot of fun. The suspension actually helped with my low back. I actually tweaked my low back yesterday, so that affected some of my handling skills, but I had a good time. It was fun even though it was on a mountain bike. All right, the bicycle trials went well. I ended up cleaning the first two loops on uh, the Charles bicycle, then switched to a mountain bike and cleaned that loop as well. So the sections are pretty similar, but pretty fun. I've ridden a bunch of different bikes on this event, so fun to add another one to that list. Now, Saturday, time to ride some motorcycles. good again. That made up for it though. Today went well. The sections were on the easy side this year. They are pretty similar year to year. There's only so much you can work with. I didn't get a whole lot of footage of myself. I tried to focus on the other champs so you can see more of them. Hopefully you guys enjoy that. If you want to see more of me on this stuff, you can check out the video from years past. But it was still a lot of fun even though I didn't have any points and we're at a new venue tomorrow so I'm looking forward to that. So you finished seventh today with 10 points, tied for fourth but lost out on cleans. How'd the day go? It's actually really easy. There was probably one hard section. The one hard section had this one off sand turn area. And what was funny is I three did the very first loop and that was where I screwed up and I cleaned the corners the very first time. But then the second two loops, I screwed up the corner and ended up cleaning the sand area. Yeah, I cleaned it. Now the real event begins with some RC crawl in action. You blew it. Oh, you went in deep. Tons of sweet lines out here. Tons of traction too. Nice. Sometimes you just gotta blip it. Oh yeah. There are just endless awesome lines out here. Pretty cool how it's layered, so you got your choice. And it's pretty long, so it's got a good crawl in. Time to jump in the water. Once Hannah gets up this, that is. Got it. 
Get on that left side for some traction. Oh, look at that. You're almost there. Nice. There we go. Water time. Sunday's event ended up getting canceled due to flooding, which was a huge bummer for everyone involved. I feel bad for the people that put the time in to clear out a new place. Hopefully it will still be available next year and they could try it again. But to make up for it, I'm going to give a t-shirt away. So if you're still watching and you want to win a t-shirt, comment below with your size and state because it is only open to people in the US this time. International shipping is expensive and I'm cheap.